The surest guarantee that no nation will dare again to attack us is to remain strong in the only kind of strength an aggressor understands, military power. <laughs> the backbone of our military force should be the trained citizen who is first and foremost a civilian and who becomes a soldier or a sailor only in time of danger and only when Congress considers it necessary. This plan is obviously more practical and economical. It conforms more closely to long-standing American tradition. In such a system, however, the citizen reserve must be a trained reserve. We can meet the need for a trained reserve in only one way by universal training. But the basic reason for universal training is a very simple one, to guarantee the safety and freedom of the United States against any potential aggressor.